Welcome everyone to Ebenezer and the Invisible World from Nintendo Switch. Looks like it's gonna be a, a Ebenezer Scrooge thing. Yes, it is. Of course it would be. Oh, but they made him. They made him a badass. This is. Oh my God. This is basically Castlevania. It's a Metroidvania type thing. Okay. This looks very much like Castlevania, but in the world of uh, of Ebenezer Scrooge. Yeah, it very much is like a Metroidvania type thing. Definitely. Hollow Knight, maybe. More, more recently, Hollow Knight esque. But it also reminds me of Castlevania. Undercover secrets, yes. Oh, that's nice. I wouldn't find any of those secrets. I, I swear, I swear to the Lordy up above, I'm not gonna find any of those secrets. I hardly found any secrets to begin with. Like, seriously, oh, there we go. Christmas past, the characters, the butcher, the the blue lady, whoever she is, confront epic bosses. Oh yeah, it's definitely in the vein of Hollow Knight. Like just the 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 um the graphics are a little bit more in the vein of Hollow Knight. The world looks very much Hollow Knight esque too. But yeah, it's it's basically a, a Metroidvania style game, which Hollow Knight was a part of too. Still looks good. They didn't just like use the the they didn't just like abuse the um Orbit Studios. Were they the ones who did Hollow Knight? I don't know. Play on word worlds. The thing is, it's like you can tell that they put in a lot of effort. You can tell that they're doing their best and they are doing what they can to make sure that people enjoy what, you know, what's being shown there. Uh, and if it's Hollow Knight-esque, a lot of people are going to enjoy it because a lot of people enjoyed Hollow Knight. Will they get the same same uh, fame as Hollow Knight? I don't think so. That was kind of one of those uh, lightning striking in a bottle situations. It was kind of one, one in a million type of things, I think. And that's the that's the issue that a lot of people have nowadays. There's just so many new games coming out, so many new titles coming out. I'm not going to finish half of the things that I did. Like Starfield, I never finished. Starfield, I didn't continue because I kind of got bored of it, to be honest with you. That's the, that's what happens with my squirrel self. I get bored of it. I try to finish things nowadays, like some of them. Like uh, Mario Wonder, I'm going to try to finish. Uh, I don't know if there's any other ones out there that I need to finish. I know I'm going to finish Robocop. One way or another, I'm going to finish Robocop. Whether doing it on like streams or doing it in videos, I'm going to finish Robocop one way or another. Honestly, I am. And uh, I'm going to do what I can. I'm definitely going to do what I can. That definitely does look like a cool game. So thank you very much. This is the Mad Salvi saying I will talk to you next time. See you in the next video for this case. Thank you so much for watching.